So the next thing that happened on Monday Night Raw, we get to the next match of the night. But before we talk about that match, we got to talk about a segment that happened before this match. So yeah, we see uh, Jackie Redman interviewing the Intercontinental Champion Sami Zayn. And Sami Zayn was talking about the match earlier tonight between Braun Breaker and Ilya Dragunov. And he says that Braun Breaker better bring his A game uh, at SummerSlam and all that stuff. And he better not underestimate him because if he does then he's going to lose again, just like how he did at Money in the Bank. So yeah, that's what Sami Zayn was talking about, and how he will do anything to keep his Intercontinental Championship. So yeah, that's what he was talking about. But then all of a sudden, uh, Sami starts hearing noises going down, so Sami follows a noise. And then come to find out, we see uh, JD McDonough and Carlito attacking Jey Uso backstage. Sami Zayn comes up brawling with them as well, and uh, chased off the Judgment Day. So yeah, uh, he saved Jey Uso tonight. But yeah, that's what happened there. Pretty good part right there. But then after that, we get to the next match of the night. It was Otis and Akira Tozawa with Maxime Dupree at Ringside Alpha Academy and Xavier Woods versus Karrion Cross and Razor Akum, the Authors of Pain, with Scarlet and Paul Ellering, the Final Testament, in a six-man tag team match. So yeah, we get to this six-man tag team match, and it was a pretty good one. Otis takes out, uh, I think it was Akum at one point with the Caterpillar. The elbow drop onto him, and then uh, Otis got knocked out of the ring by Razor, and then uh, we see a character Tazawa hitting a crossbody off the top turnbuckle on the Razor outside of the ring. Uh, at one point, we actually see everybody keep on popping up on the ring apron, including Akam, and he got hit with a super kick by Woods, and then uh, we see Karrion Cross pick up Woods on his shoulders, and hits that finish move, the final prayer, onto him, pinning him for the one, two, three. So yeah, the final testament defeated uh, Xavier Woods and Alpha Academy tonight in a six-man tag team match. That's what happened for that six-man tag match. I'll give it two and a half stars. That's why I'll give that one. But yeah, that's what happened there. And yeah. Then after that, we see Chad Gable and the Cree brothers, Brutus Creed and Julius Creed, coming out to the ring. And they got something to say, but, you know, that's after the commercial break. So, yeah, I'll see you guys later. Till then.